Adventurous kids explore with education and learning what a wildlife is in the Everglades. I want to explore the Museum of Discovery Science. What plants do butterflies like? I want to know about Key West Adventurous Kids. Learning and fun. Adventurous Kids! Today I'm going to tell you about blood glucose meters. A blood glucose meter, also known as a glucometer, measures the amount of glucose in your body by analyzing a drop of blood on a test strip. Some meters use electricity to measure the strip, while others measure light reflection. Blood glucose meters can help you track your blood sugar levels, monitor how well your diabetes medications are working, and understand how your diet and exercise can affect your blood sugar. Diabetes is a chronic disease that occurs when the body doesn't produce enough insulin or can use it properly. To use a blood glucose meter, you'll need a lancet to prick your finger, a test strip, and a controlled solution to test the meter. Choose a spot on the side of one of your fingers. It won't hurt as much as the top and it's much less likely to bruise. They don't always take your samples from the same finger. You should wash your hands and then dry them completely before testing. I used the correct test strip for your meter. If you don't get a drop of blood, push on the scan below where you lanced. If you still don't get a drop, don't worry, just try again on another finger. You may want to let your arm dangle down to collect more blood in your hand. Make sure your blood glucose meter is ready to read a sample, then place the drop of blood on a test strip and into the meter. The meter displays the blood sugar level on the screen within seconds. Some blood glucose meters can record hundreds of different readings. Your doctor will probably tell you to record your reading along with the date, time, and any other useful information. The doctor will tell you when to take a reading. It could be as often as a few times a day or just a couple times a week. You should carefully go over how your blood glucose meter works with your doctor and parents. Your test results may be less accurate if you are dehydrated, have low red blood cell count, or taking certain medications. You should protect your meter and test strips from extreme temperatures and humidity. Test strips should be stored in their original bottle in a dry place at room temperature away from light. The cap should be closed tightly to protect the strips from moisture, heat, and falling out of the bottle. All testing supplies should be kept out of reach of children and pets. You should also replace the batteries in your meter as needed and replace the meter every four to five years. Blood sugar levels can be affected by many things, including diet, exercise stress, and diabetes medicine. Some blood glucose meters have additional features, such as Bluetooth, some meters can connect to a smartphone app to record your data and trends. Audio. Some meters have audio pumps for people with vision impairments. And backlit screen. Some meters have backlit screens to make it easier to read in low light. Thank you for watching this episode of Adventurous Kids. What did you learn today? Adventurous Kids. Adventurous Kids. What was the most interesting fact? Adventurous Kids. Adventurous kids!